by Hook. Uh, this is number 194. And today I thought, uh, I've been searching through my, uh, my, my, my rubbish I've got and uh, just to see if, uh, uh, for, for inspiration I've been looking for, I found a, I found a, a sketch I did some many years ago. It must have been on site on a piece of thin paper like this, you know, which affects on a piece of ordinary paper. And I, uh, I pop picked it out, and, and that that's it. So um, it's going to be based on that one. So at least that's what we're based on. And, and strangely enough, I, I did one before by the cornfields, and that that was based on that one. So so th th there's where some of my inspirations coming from. So I thought I'd show you those, so you see what we've been doing, and uh, and I think uh, yeah, they're the colours I'm going to use there. That's the the, the usual colours I use. Right, once you've seen them, you can you can take take the colours off there, and then we can get on with our painting, can't we? So what we've got to start with is is a, is a, like a, a, a Coastal village. I can't, you know, I can't remember where it is, but uh, it must be nice because I painted from from the sea, and uh, it's got a bit, a bit of church there, church, one or two buildings, uh, trees, etc. One or two hills and stuff in the background, and some moored boats here and a bit of sea. Right? Okay. Let, let's start, shall we? Uh, so we'll have a nice day, and uh, well, I think we'll have the the, the full sun on, on on the face of the, the this church and stuff like that. that that'd be nice. So we'll have a nice sunny day. A uh, bit of, perhaps a bit of cumulus about. Clean water. A touch of sunshine in there. And uh, we'll have some ultramarine blue into there. Nice clouds out there. A touch of uh, a bit of lettering down to the bottom of the sky there. Am I not too strong? It's that's better. And the lights from the left over there, so we'll get a bit of shadowy stuff. Not too strong. On the on the underside of these these clouds here, because in the distance they get smaller, don't they? So we'll have one, two around here, and two coming around there. The light coming catching on the underside of that, the shadow, I should say. Should see us through the cloud. Just uh, flicking the the shadow as, it, as, as the sun hits the the cloud itself. It, it creates shadows underneath on the bottom side of it, doesn't it? So it's, it's nice to sort of generate some of that that, uh, that that cloud shadow on the underside. But I don't want to get too busy with it. Uh, I could put a touch of, just a touch of dark in there, just to because it's too nice. Close that corner down. Too 
carrot there as well. Now I'm starting to fiddle, so stop. Now well, that's dry now. Uh, let, let's pop in these these like mountains and stuff in the background first. That one's a forest away. This one's closer to us, and that's closer to us than, than the other one. So keep this one pale. Let's have used this um, a, a lizard crimson and a bit of a touch of the uh, uh, ultramarine blue into it. And let's see if we can, we can give this one some depth, some distances. So that's that's away from us really. Uh, that's that can be a little bit paler. That yeah. this I want to put into just some a, a, just a touch of green into this actually into the bottom of this just to sort of show it's just not too far away and there's there's, there's green in it. This is cadmium, cadmium yellow and, and winds of a red shade. Just to sort of show a bit, a bit, a bit of shape to it and, and, and as it's coming closer it's getting a bit greeny. That'll do not too much. I'll dry that a bit. Well, that's dry now. Now this next one, I've got some same, same colour, cadmium yellow and winds of a red shade, but a, a little bit stronger this time. Just to sort of uh, take us take us further forward, a more distinct line on this one. Takes it down to sea level. This mind the boat. And the church, number ten brush. This, so it's not a fiddle brush, but, but, but you've got to be careful with it. What's the top of the church there? Right, that's right. Now this this hillside here, this is a little bit closer, so that's going to be a little bit stronger than what the paint we had there, isn't it? So this one is going to come in from from here. And it shows a bit a bit stronger there. Got to be careful here, because I'm right in amongst the church there. So it's coming quite, getting some quite nice darks on this one. As, as the hillside is coming closer to us. That's another one to dry. All right, that's dry. Let, let's come to some of the, these few few buildings and church and that. Let, let's see if we can get that that popped in. And. Uh, I've got some raw sienna for this. Nice colour raw sienna. It's, it's transparent, of course, uh, and it's uh, it. You can do it with ochre if you like. If you want to do, do uh, less less transparency.
Lovely local stone, this is. Is that the, the nice glow to it, it is. I think I'll have the rose pantile, I think, on this one. Uh, I've had dry, I thought it's going to be all over everything. All right, that's dry. So let's pop in some pantile rose on this. This is, it's, uh, this is burnt sienna, by the way, folks. Oh, my head's not in the way. Burnt sienna. There's a slip down this side here as well. If I missed anything, I'm going to darken some of those a bit because it, 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 it's too being cute. It's, it's it's a bit too nice. It wants wants making a bit uh, oldy worldy. This is the the this colour here. I got out of the sky and just. Just make it a bit more, a bit more weathered. more lived in now. Uh, I'm going to put some windows in that now folks so uh, you can go and get the kettle on. I'll, I'll, it'll take me a while this, I'll probably cut some of it out. There's quite a few windows here so let, let's Cut some of this out for you. you know, board the pants up you.
Right. I'm going to put one or two um, trees behind it, if you like. Bushes, trees, call them what you like. Uh, I think I can go in without drying that, see if I can just... The shadows creative, aren't they? Right, there's a bit of a hedge around the front of this as well. So we'll pop that in. Let's get some more of these trees in first. Some out here. This brush might be a bit big for doing this. I'll go down the scale. dark in there to show it shadowy in there right there's this uh, this uh, hedgerow that it comes in front of here I suppose it's 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 stop stop people coming in from the church and the, uh, from the church and falling in the water I don't know I'm just guessing There's a lot of green. Well, that's dry now. Let's just tackle some of these books. I'm going to put the undercoat on to so that, that big one there. I'll do it with, with burnt, burnt sienna. Let's let's, uh, let's get some colour onto it. because that's too wet but what I will do I'll, I'll paint this other one here we'll have a different colour shall we uh, I think we'll have a nice blue vote for that one Try. Let's do. Let's put this other one in. We'll have a ready coloured one, shall we? dirt on these because they're they look brand new they do dirt on the bottom here this brown one as well marks on it. And 
down on this blue one a bit uh, or oh, dirt, dirty it a bit at the bottom there. Push these uprights in, haven't we? I'll try that a bit again. Right, let's pop some of these, these lines in. I've got a mile stick here, which uh, which might, might help me to keep, get a straight line. Let's help me on that one. Another straight one. And this stick, you know, I used it for oil painting really, but, uh, but I'm, I'm, I made it myself. It's, it's got a dodgy end on it. But it's, it's, it's handy for things like this. There's two little ones down here as well. We're getting there. We're getting there, folks. Turn you across this side now to, to get these angled ones. sales on this it'll look it'll look better I think it will. Just to put a sail on there, that would be nicer. Right, I put some, I put some pearl sails on this to, just to sort of to line this a bit. I'll put some water in now and see where we go from there, and then we'll do some shadows, okay? So let's do some water first. Water, 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 water. Let's have a water, number 10 brush, I think. Reflect what 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 stairs. Let's get some. Mix 
bit of darker colour there just to that's better. Dry those a bit, shall we? Right, that's dry now. Let's see if we can. Um, the light's coming from the left, isn't it? So, so we're going to get a, a shadow on certain parts of the church in that there, aren't we? So let, let's let's do that. There'd be a bit of shadow on, on on some of these boats as well. I want to emphasise that. There was some on that side there. It's against that one. This one will be in shade. This side. This dark blue here will, will be in shade here. I think we might get a touch of reflection here like this, like this. Uh, I'll, do the, I'll, do, I'll, do, I'll do the church in that first. Let's get some shadow here. From my sketch, it reflected. There's a reflection from here. Let me just look at my sketches. Can't remember now. Yeah, if we look at that. There's, a, there's a, quite a, a reflection on, on the side of the of the church there. Let's get that in, shall we? Like that. Understandably. End face will be in shade. And this face will be in shade as well. So that some of these darks will be go under these these trees here, we'll get some shadow there, won't we? And some under these bushes here, like this. Some of these space with these these trees here, some darky bits. And now I'm, I'm missing the belt, so I'll stop with that now. Now then, we we, we ought to sort of consider some uh, some some reflections here, didn't we, from the from the boat, and just a touch of colour from here.
darker colour on that one there. It's a bit dark, isn't it? Bit dark on that one. Bit of a calm sea here. Uh, the red one will also create a shadow, won't it, as well. Let's, let's see what we've got with that one. That one's a bit shadowy on that side, the shadow. So we'll see a dark on there, won't we? From there. That blue border, give it a touch more. Just here. Not too strong. It's about here. Right, we're also going to reflect these uh, these sails, aren't they? The furl sails. They all need to be reflected. Better sort them out. This is that burnt sienna, don't forget. So if we say about there. Shall not be far out, shall we? That comes off about there, doesn't it? Similar, similar treatment to this one here. Three, there's one, one just here like that. And one on this one here. Oh, I've got, I've got that mass there. It's a fiddly one, this folks. Fiddly. But there's a mass there, isn't it? in the water. Now then, I think we'll guess an evidence of a church reflecting the water as well, won't we? I think we will. If I can find the right brush to do it with. Well, let's try now. I, I thought I, mean, I might do a little bit more on these, just some, some of the shadow areas on, the, on these, these mountains in the background. You're not seeing much on them, but I think you'll find some on this one here. Signs of shadow and stuff like that. Can't have them. Just not, not showing this the shape of it with the, with the sun on it. One or two twiddly bits down here as well. Because this is this is our nearest mountain, isn't it? I can't resist it, a twiddle on that back one. I'm, I'm going to try something. But this 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 church will uh, will, it will reflect in the water really. So let's see if we can let's see if we can do some touchy reflections on this church and that. It comes down here and it. I 
that's about right but we're also going to see some uh, where the shadows are as well aren't we and the darks so let's pop some of that in that, that bit a bit dark there won't it that bit will be dark there and that bit will be dark just there and that side of the church will be dark just here won't it too far there I think with that yeah that line of that church is there It's fiddly, I'm fiddling, I'm fiddling here folks, I don't usually fiddle as bad as this, but I just want to try and get a bit of shadow in there, just to show a bit of dark, that one as well. And of course what we're also going to get, when I'm messing about, we're going to get a green down here, aren't we? Carried away here, folks. Sorry. I thought we'd have a go, though. So. far away so what I ought to do now is dry it and see where we're going from here right that's dry now I think so uh, the, the, we've got our reflection down there we've got some reflection from these boats and that the reflection of the hillside there so I just want to put a bit more emphasis on this water to break up that reflection a bit so let, let's go for it shall we put some uh, this is ultramarine and burnt umber Let's hope it's strong enough. Let, let's put some sort of... Ah, that's better. breaks up that dead dead reflection a bit it a bit more down a bit more depth in that colour there just there just to sort of ah, that's better that's what I want Have some darks down here as well to do and I don't want to do that. It's 
stop, 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 stop. That's the hardest bit, folks, knowing when to stop. Uh, I'll put a mount on that and see if it looks any any tidier. I can I'll find that, move that mile stick out of the way. I could tip my, my shed, or my studio, as people like to call it. So th th that's our, our little picture from a, from a sketchbook. Uh, I, I, don't, I don't know. I, 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 I'd love to tell you where it is, but I don't know. But it's, it's that that's based on on, on on sort of that one there. So and, and, and so it, and, and I must have done it twenty or thirty years ago. That but 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 that that's what it's based on. And that's what it's finished up as. And uh, I've enjoyed doing it. Yeah, I hope you liked it. Uh, if you did, uh, give us a give us a like and a, and a subscribe and, and and of course share it with your friends and that because we want them to join us, don't we? And uh, until next time, folks. It's it's, uh, it's goodbye. So goodbye, folks.